right, guys, ADHD here. Back with another video. Camera flip. Today is gonna be interesting because Daisy's got a coat on already. <laughs> so a lot of you guys saw Daisy in the background. My poor, poor dog has a coat around her head. She just had a surgery, so you know, love to Daisy in the chat. Hit, hit a like for me because I, I need I need the mental support. Because hit the like button for baby Daisy. She's got she had to have a surgery, so that is why she's the coat, so she can't bite her stitches. Um, unfortunately, she is fine though. She's going to be fine. She is great. That is, I'm very, very happy about that. So that is what's going on with Daisy. But today I'm gonna be having my own little bit of gear because we don't have a cone though. I, I probably need one, but we don't have a cone. So today we have what was said to be a bulletproof vest. <laughs> So Bold it comes, vest. baby. So first off, hold this. This comes in two parts. This is the first. This is the second part. Go ahead and hold that. Oh, it's pretty <laughs> heavy. What is this? Is this, a, this is not the vest, is it? This is. I guess I think the bulletproof part. So right here, this is a bulletproof vest from Wish.com. So if you guys don't know what Wish.com is, basically what it is a site where you just can buy stuff for like dirt, dirt cheap. Not a sponsor, but they basically sell Chinese made products that are really low quality. So when I found out that I could find a bulletproof vest from probably the worst place to buy a bulletproof vest, <laughs> I was like, okay. So I got a bulletproof vest for $17. $17, and you think for that's actually bulletproof? <laughs> I am betting my life on $17. And it even comes with this. So let's open up the vest first. Oh, let's just open this first. I'm very interested about this thing because I opened it up a little bit and it just feels like. Well, I don't know what you're knocking on. So you know what this sounds like? Tin. No. Listen really closely. It sounds exactly like the safe, that one we just broke into. Oh, you know what it does? <laughs> Probably just a big slab of steel. Let's open this up. Oh my god. Maybe I shouldn't trust a bulletproof vest where I have to install the bulletproof. <laughs> okay, so I got this out and wow. It's just like a big piece of metal. <laughs> so I believe this goes inside the bulletproof vest. So what if they hit you like here? What if they hit you <laughs> anywhere else? Yeah. What if they were like, hey, how about your face? <laughs> and they're like, oh, wait, hang on. I, I Give me one that. second. <laughs> okay, so that's the metal plate. Let's take a look at the vest. All right, Wish got you, you got a knife. This isn't a knife. This is a trident. <laughs> Who even has that? It's like the salad fork they give you at Olive Garden. <laughs> this is my salad mixing fork. Oh my God! Does it come in a bag? Wow. You know what? For seventeen dollars, that's pretty damn fancy, man. Pull up into the airport with this instead of a suitcase. I, I think if I walked into the airport with this thing, I might be uh, due for um, random inspections. <laughs> <So> <laughs> I probably wouldn't bring this to the airport. But let's see what it looks like inside. I'm actually. For 17 bucks, I'm pretty impressed it comes with the case. Here we go. Bulletproof vest. Let's check it out. Well, that looks pathetic. That's it? Somehow. Wow, you know what? You can actually kind of feel how there could be some kind of mylar in there. Not mylar. Um, what is it called? Kevlar. Yeah, I can almost feel it. It's like some kind of sponginess. Bulletproof? I don't know that <laughs> So what we're going to do is I'm going to be putting on this bulletproof vest, and we're going to be trying to see if the bulletproof vest is actually going to protect me. We're going to be trying to get some pretty crazy stuff, but anything too crazy, we're going to be putting it around a water jug and seeing if it actually survives. because I'm not trying to get killed here today, but we're going to see what this thing's capable of. <laughs> okay. <laughs> So Parker figured it out. This is how it works. I'm like, where does this piece get installed? So our giant metal plate, I, we believe, goes in here. Yeah, Velcro so, pouch. You just put, this is my life, my story, my legacy. And it's all going in this little pouch. Okay, yeah, I did the wrap off. I think yeah, it was, probably not. I was thinking we would need it. An extra protection. Just an extra layer of something. Okay, so here we go. That is how it works. We have a metal plate. I believe all of this has some kind of anti, like, stab proof stuff and for bullets. But oh, that's then, good to test. yeah, that's interesting. But right here, let's see if this is actually bulletproof. So we're gonna be working through all the tests. Let's see if Wish will have a decent, maybe usable type of protective bulletproof vest type thing. I'm still not gonna call it bulletproof. But let's just see if it can protect us. Okay. <laughs> ADHD homicide detective. Dun -dun 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 -dun. I don't know why I did the Monday Night Football sound, but. <laughs> You know what, dude? I feel pretty bad. I look. I look protected. You look. Well, that doesn't fit you. Well, like, uh, it's you, a little short. Yeah, a little short. Yeah, I, I feel like this is made for Chinese people. Yeah, Not in the racist way. I just, you, it's made for Chinese people. You look like the detective that's going into the raid, <laughs> but who, do, who doesn't have a gun. Rookie first day. <laughs> <laughs> I'm good, guys. Got my vest on. I'm good. All right, give me a little punch right here. You're so tough. Damn. <laughs> Ow. Dude. Okay, you know what? Okay, I kind of feel the energy, but. Uh. <laughs> 
That <laughs> dried my skin and reddened my knuckles. <laughs> All right, so now we're gonna put this thing to the extreme test. Here we go. Marcus Jones, new Smash Bros DLC. Oh yeah. <laughs> I'm the second best character besides Kirby. Okay guys, so the testing is about to begin. I have, I know you guys don't want to hear, I don't, I don't want to say it. Unfortunately, due to YouTube's new guidelines, I wanted to wear this thing for the entire video and have all the tests done on me. As you can see, we already just did one where Parker stabbed me in the chest. And as you see, I survived. It was amazing, it was a strong shield. But due to YouTube's guidelines, I can already tell that if I do that, it's gonna be some problems where the video gets demonetized or age restricted or something like that. And if you guys know about new the new guidelines, you'll understand. But basically, I cannot have this on and the test cannot be done on me otherwise we will get in trouble so i need you guys to smash the like button for for you know freedom of speech and just freedom of content right so smash the like button for me guys but we're gonna have to put it onto a water jet or something but don't worry your boy is still gonna be pushing this thing to its max we're gonna be testing it out and even at the end i'm still gonna try and put it on for hell no that i think will be a little bit safer and we'll go from there all right like i said guys you know your boy is down but i think this is gonna be a good alternative right here we have the water chug inside here so what we're gonna do is i'm I'm going to be attacking this thing relentlessly and trying to see when it survives. So this, in this situation, this water jug right here is me. You know the best thing about things? You got an ass like me too. So right here, we're gonna be trying it out body first. So if this thing, the jug is compromised, this thing's a lot, you know, it's a lot thicker than my skin. So it's safe to say if the jug gets messed up, I would have been very messed up. Here we go, let's start the testing. I'm very excited. I've never had a bulletproof vest to go against, but here we go. All right, we got Mike's hammer out here. This isn't what I'm testing with. I'm just trying to see. That's pretty damn damaging, dude. Pretty damn damaging. <laughs> pretty damn damaging. But this thing's pretty strong. I don't know, man. What do you think we should try first on it? Apparently not that, because that didn't work. <laughs> I mean, but, I'm uh, it pretty light, but it doesn't seem like it's gonna do much. That would probably hurt as in terms of impact, but like, let's uh, do a throwing knife. Let's do a throwing knife. You can do a puncture this? Oh yeah, I think it's gonna be able to puncture pretty easily. <laughs> All right. $17 bulletproof vest, hell yeah. <laughs> I cannot believe. 17 bucks. I'm bulletproof. Maybe. Possibly. So I'm gonna try and go for just a no-spin. Just truck. Try and get as much puncture as I can. Let's do it. <laughs> Dude, I didn't even hit the metal plate. You I didn't? hit the soft spot. The metal plate's down here. This is where this plate stops, guys. I hit the soft spot it didn't even go through. It didn't? Wait, no! Wait, try, try stabbing it. It doesn't. No, it does in some spots, but it doesn't. Like, down here, it does not go through. Look at that. Wow. <laughs> That's incredible! And and the plate isn't there. The plate's right here. This is just the actual vest, and it still doesn't go through. It's made with like some kind of cup for 17 bucks. That's not bad. <laughs> That's not bad at all. If you were in a budget and you were going, like honestly, like in today's society, things can happen anywhere. And we're just being 100 percent honest here. And for 17 bucks, you have a little bit more safety than anybody else in the room. That's not too bad, man. I mean, even if you just get into a like some, <laughs> you get into a, a, a scraggle with someone, you know, someone just try, punches you straight into something. Like, <laughs> and I and I've worn it. It's not that uncomfortable either. All right, last throw test. Ready? Let's do it. Oh, shit, oh that man. was right on the. Point. Oh my god! No. <laughs> No, it didn't do that. <laughs> it did it. This is a steel blade, guys, and it just bit the tip of it instantly. Oh my goodness. Okay, let's this is really for a little. I think you were wrong. I think this thing might need a little bit more heavy duty than a throwing knife. All right, so here we go. Let's just ignore the sound of the rain in the background. So, right here, we have a pistol. This is the best one we could find, the strongest we could find. We're using the Deadpool video. Not a real gun here, so we're going to try this one out and see if it actually works here. Ready? Dang, that ricochet. <laughs> that was ricochet, but the ricochet's slow. All right, here we go, ready? Yep. Oh. <laughs> the ricochet is so bad. <laughs> a couple of them hit me, but it, it, it ricocheted really slow. Dude, look. They move it in there, over there. <laughs> the camera's important, guys. <laughs> the camera, Parker's under here. I'm so under drop the light, because we have to do this. So right here, you see it absorbed it. It literally absorbed oh, it. Shit. Shoot, that's <laughs> crazy. It absorbed it. But it survived every single shot. I'm not seeing any water damage over here. I don't think there's any water leaking. Yeah, there's no water leaking. I didn't think it was gonna work, but I'm kind of amazed that that happened. All right, here we go, ready? I don't know how to shoot it through the ricochet doesn't hit us. Oh! Ooh. It tore it up, but everything bounced right off. Wow. It literally didn't do anything to it. Pistol whip, pistol whip. Go out safety before you pistol whip people. <laughs> There's no more bullets. Okay, that's it. Now I'm now I'm bringing out. Oh, Raptor geez. Whisper. <laughs> this is the strongest, one of the strongest pistol or air guns you can possibly buy. We're gonna try this one. Well, yeah, it's a Raptor's Whisper. Jesus. <laughs> 
<laughs> the only <whisper>. oh! <laughs> All right, ready? I think so. This is gonna have a really bad ricochet, so be careful. Wait, 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 wait. <laughs> I'm not ready for that ricochet. All right, three, two, one. Oh, <laughs> I was afraid of that ricochet Dude, so bad. the bullet right here. You see the hole? Oh, that's a perfect hole. All right, taking it off to see if that bullet went through. It may have actually gone through, which if it can't block a BB, I doubt it's going to block a bullet. But I was giving this thing all props. Oh, shit. Man, there was a lot of bullets in here. No, none of them made it through. Not a single no one. <laughs> That's just water. Oh, that was a reflection. I was like, what is that in there? <laughs> Look at this though. It's freaking clean. Not a single thing has gone through. Oh! <laughs> this thing's been taking massive heat. The bullet actually like fused into it. It hit it so hard. It, it just like it flattened. flattened. It flattened on there. That's literally the bullet. <laughs> wow. Props. Okay. I give it props. $17. To get this level of protection for the same price as like an In-N-Out family meal, like you know, for like a daily trip to McDonald's for some people, that's crazy. All right, just strap him back up real here, quick here. You're gonna be okay, buddy. And like I said, guys, if you guys haven't dropped a like already, we're literally filming this video in the rain because we have no other options because it's literally been raining for four days, California. Please stop. All right, guys, so here we go. The next test is the axe, my favorite weapon, as you guys know. It's become my favorite weapon, actually. So we're gonna try it. I'm saying if I was wearing this, if I was, let's say I was, a, I was at a Dodgers game, right? Axe murderer walks in, okay? Walks in the stadium, no one stops him, No one got stopped it. him, no security, nothing. He just starts oh, hacking people, oh, hacking people, oh, catch a foul ball. Oh. <laughs> He's just taking people out. And I had my vest on, would I survive? He went straight for my chest. Let's find out, ready? Let's do it. Axe murderer, ADHD, activating. Ah! Oh! Oh my god. Oh my goodness. There Dude, was nothing. No, look at this axe wound. You can see where it's sliced. I gonna do, we're gonna do a few more hits and then we're gonna take it off and see if it went through. Because I think that might have done something. You think so? I felt something like I felt some kind of give when I hit it. Well, I don't see any leakage. So let's, yeah, let's it's gonna be very hit. easy to see leakage in this kind of drain. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Give it a few more hits. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, uh -oh, no. I saw something. I think I think this might have done it. I, I think the axe might have already been its uh its weak point. I'll give it one more hit and we're gonna do a reveal. Ready? Oh, I gave it hard hits. Like that was as hard as I could hit. <laughs> Alright, let's do a reveal. Dude, it's chopped up. It's chopped up everywhere. You if this chopped. survives this, for $17, you can survive a fax attack? That would be amazing. Yeah, yeah, it's not like you're gonna be like just sitting there just taking it, like, oh, yeah, what if I was gonna survive this? You probably would only have to take one hit. So let's see. No. No! Dude! <laughs> I was almost 100% oh sure God. that those hits would have done it. That was an axe, and I even hit some of them beyond the plate. Like a few of them I did too low, and I did too high, and it still didn't break anything. For $17. For $17! You're gonna see what I'm talking about. It's impenetrable. <laughs> All right, hit it with it as hard as you can. Let me get a good better shot in a safer spot. Go for it. You said it's impenetrable? I'm telling you, it's impenetrable. I'm impenetrable. But no, you're not. You're not. <laughs> Three. Two, one, hit it. Oh, oh, oh! Well, you definitely smacked him out of his suit. But no damage! No. No way! <laughs> no damage. It definitely knocked him over. I'll give you credit for that. But there's no damage at all. Here, now he's unprotected. <laughs> now we hit him with the axe. You oh. smack him so hard, he runs out of his suit, and then you stab him. <laughs> but isn't it unbelievably strong? It's unbelievably strong. <laughs> All right, like I said, guys, rain or shine, as Parker said, <laughs> the gardener will be guarded. You guys saw him last video. What the heck is going on over there? <laughs> that son of a bitch <laughs> guards every day. All right, so here we go. I'm, I just cannot believe this thing is axe proof. So here. Oh, so we're gonna take it up a notch, and Axe is just not gonna do it. We're gonna take it up a notch. Let's get it. Wee -woo, wee -woo. <laughs> I thought they didn't do anything. That's yeah, and anyway, somebody should invent something. It's just like windshield wipers for glasses. <laughs> for those of you guys who have never seen me before, I'm glad to see you because I can create a new identity. I, for those of you guys who have never seen me before, can't open a katana. <laughs> I don't know what's happening. It's literally stuck. <laughs> I'm not even kidding. <laughs> it's stuck. <laughs> Oh, there we go. Okay. Jesus. Okay, Katana, like I was saying, I have a new identity. For those of you guys who don't know, I am the world's most leader what? in the Katana art. What? It, what? I am the best with the Katana. I can cut individual range. 
Alright guys, let's pause the video right here for a second because I was just joking about, you know, being a katana master and being able to cut water drops and all that kind of stuff. Let's just, just play the video for a second. See, I actually cut a water drop. Let's play it in slow motion and let's we'll listen to the sound. There's sound and everything. I literally cut a drop of water that was falling off of the awning. Can I get a like? I just got 16 raindrops. 12. <laughs> you, you, you subtracted the number. Yeah. Did, did you reform? Another one was 12 and one hit. That's why. <laughs> I am the master of katanas. Here we go. Ready? Oh. <laughs> That did not sound good for the katana. I, oh my god! It just dented my katana! You can't really see it too well. This is a very expensive katana, so I'm not gonna do that too many more times. Go for a stab, right? Well, we'll get my bottle for this, so if it breaks, it breaks. Ready? Here we go. Damn, that thing is sharp. Oh, oh. It chipped it. It chipped the I blade. I can see it from here. It chipped the blade, guys. <laughs> It literally chipped oh the blade. Oh my god. You know what? This katana is only becoming more dangerous. Because that's gonna like rip through your skin. <laughs> like a serration. Okay, guys. That is, I'm just messing with my katana at this point. Alright, ready? What? My god, that messed it up. That thing sliced it up, but there's still... I don't know. I didn't feel like I made it through. You have to admit, this is working out a lot better than you expected. Oh, way, <laughs> way, way more, more, more. Nothing. There's nothing. And I even well, did some of them. That's from the, that's from the ring. Yeah. Yeah, yeah the, just, just for clarification. Yeah, and I did several off of the metal plate, too. I did several of them off of the metal plate to try and see if it worked. Okay, so I'm pretty confident in this. For 17 bucks, I'm pretty confident in this thing right here. So what we're going to do is, I told you, I was going to let Parker do some tests on me, the ones I think will be fine to do. So right here, we have Parker's paintball gun. So one of the worst things you can do with a paintball gun is freeze the bullets. It's just because it's really bad. Because you're just shooting. It hurts. It hurts. It's a like lot. shooting marbles. <laughs> you're basically we shoot real bullets at that point. So what we're gonna do is I'm gonna put this on and we have some frozen paintball gun bullets and we're gonna see if I'll actually be able to fill it or if wish to make my wish come true and I'll be perfectly fine today. I voted against this. <laughs> you I... did vote against it. And I voted to do it. So All right. it's a tie. All right, yeah. So that means we're gonna do it. Yeah. <laughs> All right, well, <laughs> they're in here and they are frozen, frozen. Like, there is no oh, give at all. <laughs> oh, man. That, I, ooh. That is evil. <laughs> it's like, don't ever do this to anybody. It's very, very evil. It's a very known thing. I'm not bringing anything new here, so that's why I don't want to film. I don't feel too bad for you know, acknowledging it. But it's really jerkish. <laughs> All right, so before we do this, it was currently filled with a frozen paintball gun bullets. I want to see what it looks like on that first. Let's just test that out and see how it comes out, and then we'll go from there. I'm okay. not testing it until I see what it does to that first. Three, two, one. Oh! Oh, <laughs> oh okay, no, no more, no more. I've seen enough. Holy crap. That They're like hurt. globs now. They're like a sludge of just frozen slushy. It didn't go through, <laughs> so I should be fine. That looked like, like it hurt, it though. It looked like it hurt. <laughs> Let's My first right. the camera was like, ow! Okay, guys, so this is the test. Very, very bad idea, but it is 100% safe. So even if I did get shot by that, I wouldn't die. I would just be crying. <laughs> <laughs> so, <laughs> that's pretty much it. We're going to go into a personal cup here. Here we go. <laughs> Three, two, one. Oh, God. You felt that? I didn't feel it, but I could feel how much, because I've been shot by the regular paintball before. I could feel how that hurt way worse. It's like a lot more. Oh. All right, rapid fire. flying upward did. It felt like a little, little razor just <laughs> Shit, what your mama gave you. <laughs> oh my god, dude. It didn't do anything to it though, obviously. It just, it felt like eight, eight trigrams. <laughs> Four paws. Hurt. It didn't hurt though, it just felt like, so it just felt like vibration, a, like, a push? like oh, finger touches. Really? Yeah, I could feel the energy of like them stopping, but that was it. Wow. Just trying to get all the paint off. <laughs> but it's not waterproof, huh? <laughs> Man, it turns out <laughs> it's bulletproof, but it ain't waterproof. All this rice is- Oh god! <laughs> this rice killing me, but if there was a bullet shot, I'm ready. <laughs> okay, here we go. I'm just desperate. Man, I I hate to see you like this. It's time to give up, man. 
It's just, it's, I don't understand how. It's, a, it's an axe, Parker. I know it's an axe, but you know, you get, the thing you gotta understand is that, is that this is Wish. I just can't believe it. I'm honestly baffled. Wish. I wish that I could break this, but we just can't get through it. It's Listen, literally. It's okay. You know, it's not that you're not strong enough. You know, maybe we can get something, someone stronger, but even <laughs> if. Like, but even if this is Wish. This know? is why I invited my friend Dwayne The Rock Johnson. Ho! <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, man. I think we could do it. I just don't know. We might not have anything that's usable to break through this. Yeah, we do. What? Crossbow. I don't know if a crossbow can even get through this. Because the thing is weird. It's soft, but it's not. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, feel it. It's soft. But it's not. But it's like, but it's like tough. What I want to try is a downward slash with the axe. Because I feel like with more kinetic energy, maybe I could burst it. You really just don't want to give up on this axe, do you? It's an axe! Here, take your, take your safety glasses, axe, man. <laughs> A axe best everything. Well, you know, tank axe, bomb axe, AC 130 axe, <laughs> five star dinner axe. <laughs> axe will beat anything. Come on, axe, you can't let me down here. Ready? I'm going to go full fledged as hard as I can possibly swing down vertical on this. This will do it. Ready? Oh. Okay, I busted the top open. Oh my god. Yeah. I might have done it with that one. No way. Yeah, I think I did. I think I did. <laughs> you think you did? You think you did? <laughs> Damn! If a person was lying there, would they survive? I guess technically yes. Everything on the inside would be blood! <laughs> <laughs> Alright guys, so it turns out the crossbow didn't have any a crossbow string on it. It broke, I forgot we broke it actually. So, I ordered a new crossbow string, but to be 100% honest, I don't really know if that's even, if this will even go through it. It might. I don't want to say that without testing it. Maybe we'll test it another time. So, if you guys have any idea on how we can break through that bulletproof vest, let me know down below. It's right Raining today, so it's kind of hard to get a lot of the shots we wanted, and even to try a lot of these we wanted to do. So it, we're gonna have to just end it for here, like right here today. But what I need you guys to do, like I said, is leave a comment down below with some ideas on how we can destroy it. Anyway, that is actually it, guys. Thank you so much for watching. As always, I'll see you in the next video. Peace.